Hi, everyone. Um, Dr. J is an opportunity that I found a couple of years ago and that started from a personal journey. And the journey, um, it's where I met uh, some great experts in psychiatry, psychology, and that's where I met uh, my co-founder, who is an expert in generative AI, in predictive AI, in relation to language and mental health. And I bring uh, experience as a med tech entrepreneur uh, and a CFO. And uh, let's look at Ryan, who has uh, been feeling sad and lost for a couple of days. As days turn into weeks, um, Ryan starts feeling lonely because they start going out, seeing their friends less, and at some point they decide they might need some help. They talk with their friends and they tell, well, Ryan, you're not crazy, only crazy people would go to a psychiatrist. In a couple of weeks, they still feel they need to overcome that stigma and see someone, and that's where they see that to see a psychiatrist, they would need to wait three months. So in the end, they have to pay out of pocket to see someone faster and to get some sort of diagnosis. Well, imagine Ryan does see a psychiatrist. And psychiatrist tells Ryan, it looks like more moderate depression. We have different options. And that's where it feels like the journey would end, but it's actually the, only the beginning. Because he is now faced, uh, they now, they're now faced with uh, psychologists with more than 20 different approaches, pharmacotherapy, uh, hundreds of self-help books, uh, meditation yoga retreats, and all the potential alternative therapies they could overtake. So Ryan is not alone in this problem. One-fourth of the people worldwide suffer from mental health diseases, and more than half of them don't receive any formal diagnosis, and more than 60% of them don't receive any kind of treatment. And this leads to a huge market, and this leads to a surge of solutions, and one of the solutions being digital health, uh, mental health solutions. And because of this urgency, they are expected to grow three times within the next couple of years. Our mission at Dr. J is to provide real-time diagnostics and personalized treatment for mental health and well-being. We're using digital biomarkers to access real-time uh, diagnostics of mental health conditions. We, we monitor these conditions as the person over, um, goes over personalized treatment uh, with research-validated interventions and specific therapeutic interventions. And we provide this data back to mental health pr uh, professionals or general practitioners that follow up with a patient. So in more concrete terms, how we do it. So there's uh, the devices, the devices, I don't have my phone with me, but uh, basically 90% of the time you would have your phone with you and your phone knows more about you than you're willing to admit. Uh, we will be taking some of this data to provide a predictive analytics of your mental health state, and we will assign you to research-validated intervention. For example, if we see that you're feeling anxious, we might propose you a briefing technique. And then if this briefing technique would work for you, we might provide some other mindfulness techniques. Then if we see that it's not working for you or you're not going back to the app, we, we would have to propose you something different. So this adaptation would go in real time because in mental health, we all have different needs and different preferences. Uh, our business model is based on subscription model and we are uh, targeting uh, insurances as uh, Dr. J is, um, prov provides a strong value proposition. Um, for, uh, for their clients. We, also, we would also target clients directly, and we would target a B2B segment, as there is um, several problems now, uh, commonly sometimes named as great resignation. And we also see a digital health reimbursement trend. We see that uh, European countries are 
uh, adopting specific regulations for digital health reimbursement that in the US more and more uh, more and more uh, devices and therapeutics are uh, getting reimbursed uh, through intermediary pathways and, and, and other pathways. In terms of our unique selling proposition, uh, we use uh, generative AI and predictive AI in order to provide uh, diagnostics that is reliable and treatment that is uh, research-based and that is uh, fully personalized uh, to each of the individuals. And that, that allows us to make it affordable in comparison to uh, traditional therapy when you would be seeing your psychologist, psychiatrist every, every week or two. So we have launched and tested our uh, first intervention and more than three-fourths of people reported feeling better even after just a single interaction uh, with the platform. And we collected two years of data of uh, more than 500 patients um, and received 75% uh, accuracy for depression prediction. And this is just using uh, background data from your phone. So basically not asking any additional questions or any additional information other than the data that you're carrying in your pocket. Um, so our next step is collecting the full data set to um, improve the accuracy of the algorithm, releasing uh, the first uh, user-friendly version of an app for mobile devices and applying for regulatory pathways and reimbursement. Currently, we're raising uh, a 4 million euro seed round with the main goals of getting the data set, uh, getting the full data set for, uh, for the prediction algorithm, of releasing an um, iOS app, submitting the FDA breakthrough application, and uh, developing a clinical validation program uh, to um, solidly uh, prove the um, efficacy and efficiency of the treatment provided by, by the platform. So thank you very much for following us on this um, journey. Uh, I thank you all and uh, very excited uh, to, to share it with you.